So today, I'm really excited because Prey Dog has released his injector. Now, this injector claims to turn any, or, well, most, Unreal Engine games into VR games. And there's about 11,000 of them. Uh, uh, that's Unreal Engine 4 and Unreal Engine 5. This doesn't do all Unreal Engine 4, but some of them, and it does a shitload of Unreal Engine 5. Now, I've tried it on a few. Uh, I've tried it on up to now. I've tried it on Ghostwire, runs great. I've tried it on Hogwarts, runs great. I've tried it on Stray, and it runs great. Uh, I'm going to show you Hogwarts, and I'm going to show you where to get it from, because it's all free, and how to set it up. Uh, how to fine tune it, well that's another video, but I will leave a very useful link, a website you can go to, which tells you how to do everything. How to add the move controllers, how to change from third person to first person, to do all kinds of stuff. Uh, but first of all, let's download the mod. So, the links will be in the description. You'll have these two links, and then you go to that one once you've set it all up, and you'll get all this help that you need. But those are the videos that tell you how to basically do everything. Now, first of all, come to this page and download this. There it is. And then, come to this page and download this. The ver uh, it's the third zip file that I download. There it is. Now, we can close this shit. Oh, continue. Yeah, get on with it. We'll just close that out of the way. That's better. Now, let's go to me downloads. And I'm, I've got two little folders here. I'm going to drag this one here, the UEVR, into my Prey Dog folder. And this one, the RAPAL, which is a game launcher, into the launcher folder. Now we can close that. First of all, we'll go here. And we'll select that. Right click on it. And select extract here. There you go. Wasn't that easy? Everything about this is a piece of piss. So now what you want to do is select that one. And run as admin. Always run it as admin. Select more info and then click run anyway. Click yes. And that's it. Now, every time this pops up and you have to start a game, if you're using a Valve Index, you open, you use, sorry, you don't open, you, you use open VR. So you'll click that one. But anything other than that, like the quests, the quest one, two, and three, it's open XR. Put Nullify VR plugin on uh, and that's it now the game I'm about to try well I'm about to show you is Hogwarts and if you have it Hogwarts in native stereo like that but well, it doesn't work not for me so I've changed it to this sequential and you can also change these around if you want try different things if it doesn't work for you try something different and then you can all you can also go to the uh, Discord. I'll, I'll leave a link for that as well. Now I'm going to close that. No, I'm not. Yes, I am. I'm going to close it. And I'm going to close that. And now we're going to go to the launcher. Select it. Extract here. And double click. Uh, double click. Double click on this setup thingy here. I've already done that so I don't have to do it. It's very easy and you'll get this and once it's scanned your PC it'll tell you all the games that you've got that are compatible with this mod. I've got Grounded, Ooh. Eye on Life, Hogwarts Legacy, uh, Stray. I'm going to do Hogwarts Legacy. This is all you have to do. Just click on it and select run 1.0.0 click run again select yes and this will pop up it's waiting for Hogwarts to start so just make sure you've got that right open XR I've got it like I said most games you're going to run it on native stereo but for just this game 
me in particular, it's, I think it's my graphics card, it might not be. I'm running it on this. Right, and now all I have to do is go to my games library and click on play and sit back. Get my controllers. Do -do 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 -do. This usually takes a bit of time. That's it, you know, that's it, we've done it. Oh, here we go. You do this with every game. It's a piece of piss. And it works. It's not perfect, but it works. And this takes its time, so I might have to... Oh, here we go. Well, we have to get rid of that, so we'll just press down on both control sticks. Oh, while you're here, you can... Uh, see, you can click on that and you can change your resolution, turn it up and down a little bit. There's all kinds of shit you can mess about with here, but while it's loading, because it is, the pro it's a... Uh, oh, please wait for the process to complete. It's a little bit jittery. So I just clear that away by pressing down on your, both your thumb sticks. So it'll disappear. Look, now we can sit back and let the game load. Anytime you want to bring that menu back up again, just press down on both your thumb sticks at the same time. Do, 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 do. So this won't work on Grand Theft Auto or Red Dead Redemption, so it's a good job I've got free mods for that, which will make them VR, well convert them VR, but this one won't, it won't do it for any of the old games. Right, mouse will go here, ooh, I've got a message on my phone. Do 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 Have we done? Oh, nearly. See, look, it looks really shit at the moment, but you can mess about with the settings. And I'll, like I said earlier on, I'll leave a link and you can get all the... Look at this! Look! Now, I know I'm in third person. Wow. Now, my move controllers, are, are just, there's no hand tracking. Not with this particular game, but maybe there is a fix for that. I don't know. I'm as new to this as you are. But this is certainly working. I like it. It feels better. It doesn't look as good as Luke Ross's mod. And that's mainly because I haven't been fucking about with the settings yet. I will do. But it feels better. I'm not getting any aching in my eyes like I do with uh, Luke Ross's mod. Yeah, this... This is very nice. I could play this, but I'd rather use... Uh, again, Sebastian perhaps. mentioned sneaking oh, what? into the restricted section. That scared the shit perhaps out of me. Perhaps he'll have an idea. Anyway, that's it. I'm going now because I've got to go to work in the morning. And I've got to go to bed. And I'm tired. And I want, I want to smoke some marijuana. So I'm going to go. Bye. <laughs>